Hi, Hub Arkish, publisher at Pro Football Weekly, here with more of our exclusive NFL Way We Hear It. All the news, scoops, and rumors before they happen. And we told you about this one right here last week. Trouble in San Francisco. The offensive coaching staff in change now, in turmoil. Jimmy Ray has been fired as offensive coordinator after week three disappointment. They got spanked again and couldn't get anything done on the offensive side of the football. Quarterbacks coach Mike Johnson takes over. Now Johnson is one of the guys who was involved in some of the miscommunication in the play calling and getting the plays in on time. Mike Singletary gave him the job. Well, apparently that didn't fix everything because now Jimmy Ray is gone. The real issue here, this is the eighth new offensive coordinator in eight years in San Francisco. It's the third one in less than three full years under Mike Singletary. And you have to wonder, who's really in control of the system here? Is there really a plan? Now, Mike Singletary, master motivator, no question about that. That's what made him a great football player. But he's not an X's and O's guy. He's not running his own defense. Greg Minuski is doing that. He couldn't get Jimmy Ray to run the offense. Now he's going to trust Mike Johnson. But the bottom line is Singletary is not a guy who can step in and help his young offensive coordinator. He's got a young quarterback, Alex Smith, who appears to be developing and then takes two steps backwards. The bottom line is this is a very, very significant move following the third week of the season for a team predicted to win the NFC West and now sitting at 0-3. Is it too little, too late? We'll keep a close eye for you right here at ProFootballWeekly.com on this story.